Hey, McDowan here. Today we are taking a look at the 4-inch Fortnite action figure Triggerfish from Jazzwares. Out of impatience, I ordered this figure from the UK and I want to shout out IDH Custom Toys for his help and I really do appreciate it. Anyway, this figure should be about $9.99 when it arrives at Walmart in the States. So, let's take a look at the back of the box. Triggerfish, stick it to him. And here we have the cross sale. After today, we will only have the Ice King left to look at. And for those who want to see the barcode, here it is. Alright, let's get this figure out of the box and take a look at him. If you are new to the channel, welcome and please subscribe so you'll be notified of future videos. If you want to help the channel out and you play Fortnite, please feel free to add my creator code to your epic account. It's McDowan. Triggerfish is a rare skin and he's part of the fish food set. Released in Chapter 2 Season 1, this skin can be purchased for 1200 V-Bucks in-game when available. He comes with the fresh cut harvesting tool and it's another nice looking harvesting tool from this Fortnite action figure series. It's pretty much just gray, kind of a steel gray maybe, gunmetal gray, a little bit of uh, green wrapping right there. The blades are a little bit lighter so that it looks like it's a sharp steel, a sharp blade. Very nice. Now we get to the Triggerfish figure. He is about four inches tall. There he is next to Fennec, so you can see a height comparison. Has 28 points of articulation. He's a typical figure. And so now we'll take a look at the articulation. So his head rotates around. This is on a ball joint, and it's kind of open down here, so you've got kind of more of the bobblehead type of a feel. It kind of just rolls around all over. The scarf makes... Uh, creates a hindrance so you can't really uh, move the head up and down much it's gonna be more of the the bobbly on the the ball joint there <laughs> I got that across the arms rotate all the way around these solo figures have really seemed to have some difficult shoulders to ratchet up so his arms will go up about that far you can rotate around and they'll go straight up I think I keep forgetting to show that part off but yeah you can uh, Hands up, the fish police are here. I don't know. His elbows rotate and hinge. These ones are a lot better than a couple of the others I've seen. Both of them are. His wrists will rotate and hinge as well. Ooh, there's some paint coming off. Look at that. Some paint is popping off. It just flung at me. He's got a bit of a torso movement. If you want him to lean forward, he goes about that far. If you want him to lean back, he goes about that far. It's kind of tight. He's got these pouches around the front that kind of hinder that movement. He His waist will rotate back and forth, but it won't go all the way. It has a stopping point of about that far. If you want him to do the splits, well, he's not going to because he's got pouches all over the place and he's got these strange little fish scale ruffly things under the pants that prevent him from going much further than that. He's got a uh, rotation at the thigh, double pin at the knee, and then finally the ankle has a hinge and a rotation. It will allow him to uh, lean backwards and lean forwards and stuff like that. So yeah, so that's Trigger Fish. And I, this is kind of an interesting figure. I'm not a, I'm not really a big fan of this figure. I mean, sorry, I'm not really a big fan of the fish stick figure, uh, characters in game. But I think this one looks really good. I actually do like this one. I like, I have enjoyed the fish stick action figures better than the one characters in game. So anyway, yeah. Um, the detail on the vest through this area is pretty good too. You can see the shotgun. I think these are shotgun casings or shells. There's a little pouch there, blues and yellows, and looks like a jelly marking there. But yeah, I think the detail, there's some really cool things on here. It's kind of interesting that this is not the default style of this skin in game, but they used one of the optional ones with, with this uh, helmet and can these be night vision goggles underwater? Maybe these are underwater night vision goggles or uh, goggle monoscope thing. I don't know. But yeah, this is a, one of the optional styles of this figure that they've used, which is good, which is cool. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty neat. And I, I really do like this figure. 
I I think it I think the figure is far superior than the skin itself and I know there's people out there who are going to disagree and that's fine I'm just not a huge fan of the fish stick skins I don't know why it's, there's something about them that's not really appealing to me but anyway here is trigger fish so now it's your turn what do you think about this figure leave your thoughts in the comment section below and before you go if you haven't already I'm pushing real hard I want you all to see the kit figure check out kit in the lower left hand corner it came with the supply llama uh, set a while back so anyway thank you for watching please like this video and share it everywhere it really helps the channel to grow I'll see you in the next video